So my name is Jarminia and I'm a jewelry designer and entrepreneur. I'm Afro-Latina, my mom is Honduran and my dad's Puerto Rican. Did you always have this pride in, in your heritage? It was certainly always there because it's in my family already, right. but I'll tell you a story about how I came to wear my hair out for the first time like mm. in public because it was also something as a child that was like, this needs to be tamed. You can't go out on the street mm. like that. And, like, and, and, and that word, tamed. tamed. One day during lunch, two friends of mine, they asked me, hey, Jeremy, you always bring your hair in these twists. Is that your hair? I'm like, no, it's not my hair. They're like, well, what's your hair like outside of the twists? And they, I came to school with my hair out. They're like, oh my God, it's so cool. I was like, oh, it's cool? You know, like, oh, cool, I can do this. Right. Yeah. To maintain natural hair, there is a whole like set of knowledge. Yeah that women are like fighting to learn. Or, or women are fighting to reclaim. To reclaim. Right, so we don't go natural, we return. And we don't learn these things, we reclaim it. Right. Right. Shea is not new. Coconut oil is not new, right? It's a re-reclamation of something that potentially was lost. And so what I hope Pure Persona will represent is a reclamation of our stories and who we are. And by reclaiming that, we were able to engage in that introspection, to take it back so that we were able to do what? Seek and see the beautiful within ourselves, for ourselves.